Hi, I'm Mary Thingval. I'm a community builder at Chef, and I'm here with Courtney Nash, who oh. is co-chair of Velocity Conference. Yes. So how's the conference going for you? Uh, Chef Conference. Yes. So Chef Conf is good. Um, it's grown a lot since I came to the first one I think I came to was three years ago. Okay. Um, so that's, you can see the uh, large growth in the community yes. for Chef, which is really it's cool. It's exciting. Yeah. So um, yeah, Chef has a long standing connection to our conference, Velocity Conference. Mm -hmm. um, Jesse Robbins, who used to be with Chef, uh, right. was one of the co-chairs back in the day. Mm -hmm. And uh, I think the lore is that Adam Jacobs showed the first lines of Chef to John Alspa at uh, the Velocity Summit way back in the day. So, I believe so. So we've always been yes, intertwined. Yes, intertwined. Yeah. yeah. So tell me a little bit about uh, Velocity and your plans for this year and where we're headed with that. Yeah, so um, Velocity is a conference that's probably very near and dear to chef, Chef's hearts. Um, you know, born out of sort of a collaboration between front end developers and back end operations people. It's kind of the a little bit of the ground zero of DevOps to a certain degree, although I don't think anyone can really claim, you know, true. <laughs> that, that would, like to. That would not be terribly DevOpsy, I think, to try to. <laughs> but, um, and so, it, you know, it's evolved a lot over the last many years that, wh well, what we've seen happen at Velocity Comps, the same kind of things that people are talking about at Chef, but you watched what what DevOps was then and what it is now are such, in, in some ways, very different. I think you were talking, there was some of this in the in the keynotes today, right. sort of DevOps, you know, predictions, yeah. right? Right, so we had a panel of people from Microsoft and Gap and Facebook talking about, you know, have your predictions about DevOps come true? What's changed? What's different? Um, and just some thoughts around, you know, how, how it's changed over the last few years. And yeah. a lot of things have grown. There's been a lot more tools that are available now. Um, the culture has changed a lot. And yep. so I know you're really into invested in and interested in the culture side of DevOps as well, yep. um, and both how that affects smaller companies as well as bigger businesses. Yeah. I mean, I think what, what we didn't see coming, or at least what I didn't, a lot of people didn't necessarily see coming, but I feel like I kind of saw it coming, was because the real promise of the DevOps you know, movement was on the cultural side, mm -hmm. that you know, you have you have seen it move into places and organizations that people might not have originally thought about. You right. know, and I think people, the way it's named, you think about it still being about you know dev and ops. Mm -hmm. But the reality is, is that the way that these kind of DevOps-driven organizations work, they've been changing the way the businesses work. Right. So it's been bleeding out, you know, into all these other aspects of the mm -hmm. business, and it's changing, you know, the very nature of how businesses work. I mean, you have you have Gap and Microsoft talking about DevOps. Like, I right. don't think I would have predicted that no. five years ago. No. So Especially that, not open sourcing things and, yeah. and making everything available. Yeah. So, um, a pretty incredible shift. Yeah. So, you know, sort of open sourcing all the things mm -hmm. uh, definitely was a big shift for that. Um, right. But the business impact, I didn't think I'd be talking about that for sure when I first started getting involved with Velocity. Right. Um, but we're talking a lot more about that this year, mm -hmm. um, which I think makes some people a little uncomfortable. Um, some people are kind of excited about it. So it's an interesting right shift. Um, so we still have a lot of the really core technical content at Velocity, mm -hmm. um, but we've added a track this year that's essentially like a business track. Okay. Um, so we're calling it Building the Optimized Business. And it's a whole day. It's right. a day long, one day, you know, one track kind of thing where mm -hmm. we're, what we are seeing a lot at Velocity is, is people would come to the conference, they'd get the religion, mm -hmm. they'd go back to their organization, like we're going to do the DevOps or, you know, we're going to, you know, optimize all the performance and right. they would like run into a wall. Um, as I'm sure people who are really interested in Chef have had, you know, you go back yeah. to organization, it's really hard to sell Absolutely. what like a business side might see as like mm -hmm. hygiene or, yeah. you know, just tidying up your servers or, you mm -hmm. know, like whatever the misperceptions might be. Um, and so we thought, well, why not DevOps that and bring the business to the conference right. um, and, you know, help those people see how this stuff is going to help the bottom line and the top line and help right. them like make their businesses move faster. Mm -hmm. So. Um, that's kind of the goal of that business day at Velocity. It's the first time we're doing it this year in cool. Santa Clara, so pretty excited about that. No, it sounds great. Yeah. And it sounds like, I mean, part of the concept of DevOps is, you know, it's like you said, it started with the developers and the operations teams working together, but the cultural side of it includes more than just the dev and ops teams. It's, yeah. it's the marketing teams, it's the, you know, um, sales teams, it's everyone yeah. working together for the same goals and, and collaborating and using the tools, but it's more about the cultural change and that really affects the whole business. Well, you could take the classic example from DevOps of, right, and it's the it's the picture of the little girl with the world burning down behind her, right? It's right. like, worked fine and you know on my machine, now it's ops problem. Mm -hmm. So just take that picture and swap out business and you know the, the developer side. So it's like, right. here's all my features, 
good luck with that. I'm, right. I'm going to the bar. Like yeah. that situation still happens. Oh, absolutely. Um, and so that's like, to me, that's sort of the next frontier of like, how do you push all that stuff into right. having that work in a business Very cool. uh, context. So, yeah. no, it sounds like a great opportunity and a yeah. good, good move for the conference too. I hope so. Yeah. yeah. We'll see. Cool. So, yeah. All right. Well, thanks a lot. I appreciate you coming out and talking to us and enjoy the rest of the conference. Yeah. Good job. Okay. Thanks.